Hey what's up guys this is Arjun Thakur and you're watching Bara Tech and today in this video I'll be showing you how you can flash the secret rom which is based on Android 9 that is Android Pie so without wasting any further time let's get started <laughs> Now if you are flashing the ROM, take an Android backup and backup all of your data. Now reboot to the recovery and once you are reboot to recovery, go to advanced wipe, select data, dial wake, cache, system and swipe to wipe and wait until everything is done. Now once everything is successfully wiped, now we need to locate the ROM and flash it. Now once the ROM is successfully flashed, now we need to flash the Google Apps that is the G Apps package. So currently here I am using the Aroma package and you can flash any package of your choice. Now once the G apps are successfully flashed, we need to flash the cigarette pie fix. As this ROM is on the alpha stage, it has some bugs and in order to fix those bugs, there is one single file which contains all the fixes. So you need to flash just one and one file. Now once the cigarette pie fixed is flashed, now let's flash the moto camera. The moto camera on this ROM works pretty fine with all the modes active. So let's flash it. Now once Moto camera is successfully flashed, let's flash Majisk and Majisk is having some problems on this ROM and I have given the fix in this video so stay tuned till the end. Now if you are thinking that let's flash the Majisk modules, don't try it will end with process 1 as i told you earlier this rom is having some problems with majisk and in order to fix it stay tuned till the end as i told you the majisk module with end with process 1 so don't flash it now once everything is done let's go to reboot and reboot to the system and as this is the first reboot this will take about 10 to 12 minutes as this is the very initial boot you might face some problems while booting to the system like your warning screen may go blank and once again appear but don't worry it will reboot like all other roms and very smoothly so wait now as you guys can see the rom is successfully booted and i am skipping all the setup process Now once everything is set up, you can see the whole new Android Pie and let me go to the setting and show you the Android version. As you can see here, this is based on Android 9 and here is the easter egg. And you can see there is some teal color accent as this is not based on any of the pixel based ROM. As this is a very initial build for our device. It is very great to see that the moto actions work perfectly fine. Let me show here. Like I have enabled long tab in order to turn the screen off. And here you can see it is working perfectly fine. And the fingerprint works fine. The fingerprint gestures work fine. The moto actions like chop chop for the flashlight and twist for the camera app works extremely fine and this rom is based on extreme plus kernel and it is very awesome kernel also this rom features digital well-being which is the pixel exclusive feature but it is working awesomely on this rom also you get some minor customizations in the celestial ways but the status bar you cannot modify it as the settings will stop and or either restart However, you can change little bit of things in the customization options like the lock screen or system, it all works fine.
If you can't change the status bar icon, you can change some quick setting options like the amount of tiles and the quick setting panels. Like I have changed it to 3 as it was on 5. Battery life on this ROM is claimed to be very good by the testers. However, I will be giving you the review for this ROM, so stay tuned to my channel. And I would also like to give a great thanks to Mr. Genetic Engineer, who is the developer for this ROM, and have given us the treble support and also this beautiful Android Pie ROM. As you guys remember we flashed the moto camera and let me show you how it works. Let's continue and grant it all the permissions that it needs and here you can see it's having all the modes active and you can use every one of them. As I told you earlier in this video that Majisk had some problems with this ROM and as you can see we are not able to see the Majisk Manager app in the app drawer even after searching in the app drawer. So in order to fix it first you need to locate where you have kept the Majisk Manager sorry the Majisk root package. As I have kept it in the download folder, I will navigate to it and I will open it, go to common and find this majisk.apk file. Now we need to extract this ROM. So let's extract it. It's your choice where you have to extract it. Like I will be extracting it in the SD card. Now once the Majisk APK is successfully extracted, let's navigate to it and install it. So let's click on it, continue and install it. Now once the Majisk manager is successfully installed, we can see it in the app drawer. And if we open it, it is working perfectly fine. And let's check the safety net status. And for your knowledge, the safety net status is good it's working fine everything is true so guys please stay tuned to the channel as i will be giving you the review for this rom and i will also be telling you how you can customize some of the things using the magisk module so subscribe to the channel and press the notification bell to stay tuned thank you guys for watching please subscribe to the channel now please till then peace